Hi, my name's Amanda Sherman. I'm a junior studying marketing and drama, and I'm back for another video reflecting on the end of the year. What are some academic and non-academic accomplishments that you've achieved throughout this year? Um, well, I just got a writing award, <gasps> technical writing. I've grown a lot intellectually and like mentally. Being pre-med, getting through all my uh, classes and stuff like organic chemistry. I survived a, a bike team crash um, in my first race uh, with the team. And Shout out Cycling yeah. Club! I'm part of Studio Tesla and we ran our first big in-person event. Getting lavender matches from Whispers. Oh. That's my biggest account. <laughs> Have you had their everything bagels? It's really oh, good. I'm that about too. to go get one. I think I've learned a better work-life balance. I'm trying to learn that. Can I ask you like two questions? <laughs> no, let's run, let's run, let's run. Okay. What have been some accomplishments you've achieved this year at WashU? Coming back to school in person, it's been good to get back on those time management skills. I'm the president of TEDx Whistle, so I helped plan the event. What are some of your accomplishments? Honestly, uh, being in rent, that was really fun. Me and Leo won a game at a badminton <laughs> tournament. Oh my goodness, congrats, a single Batman! Game, a single game. Yeah, a single game. I make music, so I was able to perform my first live concert, which was a lot of fun. Living independently for the first time, success. How's it been? I love it. I love it too. I got into occupational therapy school and I'm starting the grad school program in the fall. Getting a summer internship. <gasps> Where are you working? Nestle. <laughs> oh my god, that's so cool. I love chocolate. <laughs> I was reselected for a fellowship this summer at Tyson Research Center to do environmental biology and conservation work. Oh my god, you guys are a really impressive bunch. <laughs> um, I think the biggest highlight was being part of Carnaval. <gasps> oh my god, I saw Carnival, it was so good. It was really great. I was part of the Roomba group. So um... I feel like I'm having a celebrity encounter. <laughs> and how are you decompressing during this reading week? It's a great question. I'm, I'm not. <laughs> Coffee. Coffee. Yeah. Definitely a lot of Netflix. I went to a baseball game. I... Go card. <laughs> yes. I'm going to the gym. I've been working out more. Uh... Can't relate. <laughs> I pet a lot of dogs oh in my, my God. building. Yeah. I love that. Yeah, there's this little corgi in my building. He's great. We love corgis. Honestly, just a lot of late nights with the homies, you know, just catching up, sitting and relaxing a bit. Yeah. It's going on walks around campus with my earbuds in, a nice playlist, things like that. Okay, but like what songs? Just very sad songs. Phoebe Bridges? Potentially. She's my favorite. Um, I'm going to the gym every single day, so that's like my motivation to keep going. <laughs> I'm eating ice cream. I love those answers. Napping. Yes. <laughs> How have you been able to decompress on this reading week? Running. <laughs> running. Running. Thanks, guys. Thanks for watching and have a great summer. I'll see you next time.